Next to a heartbreaking plea from the parents of that young man who went on a killing spree in a Colorado movie theater two summers ago. You'll remember James Holmes with the fiery orange hair there, the glazed eyes. Tonight, his parents speaking out about the son they love, asking the courts to spare his life because they say he is mentally ill. ABC's Neil Karlinski tonight. In the more than two years since James Holmes allegedly went on a shooting spree inside a Colorado movie theater, killing 12 and wounding more than 60, his parents have shown their support attending court hearings but remaining silent until now. We've spent every moment for more than two years thinking about those who were injured, they write. We wish that July 20th, 2012 never happened. In a letter to prosecutors, Robert and Arlene Holmes show the anguish of devoted parents who are essentially begging for their son's life as his trial date approaches. We do not know how many victims of the theater shooting would like to see our son killed, but we are aware of people's sentiments. He's not a monster. He is a human being gripped by a severe mental illness. The victims and their loved ones have reacted harshly. There should be no compromise for a person who kills 12 people. Holmes has pleaded not guilty by reason of insanity and faces the death penalty. His parents say, we love our son, we have always loved him, and we do not want him to be executed. A painful argument for victims who say they were never given a choice. Neil Karlinski, ABC News, Los Angeles.